Did you already take a pic for the post, dude? You post it? No. All right, let's hit this shit. So, the intro. Yeah. Music starts. Music we starts. Going out there. We're out there. Say horse, ride a cowboy. Eastwood. And I'm the Taj, I'm the Taj Ranger, hero to all. And if you have a white Bronco parked outside, uh, you left your saddle on. You said, thanks for galloping. Oh, fuck. Thanks for galloping your way to the first ever funny story. Yeah. And uh, if you left uh, your white Bronco outside, uh, if, you, if you have a white Bronco, uh, you left your saddle on. Mm. I'll, you, I'll do that better in the show. <laughs> If you, uh, if you uh, came here in a white Bronco, uh, you left your saddle on. That was one. Yeah. But you know, big thank you to all you who listened to that song and took away the message of it, which is save a horse and carpool. Uh, I don't really know if that's what that song's talking about. Whoa, whoa, Alex, I know you're old, but you're not naive. I mean, of course it's about carpooling, which, you know, helps eliminate toxins in the air and, you know, can lead to deadly diseases out there. I think the only thing that song is spreading is chlamydia. Oh. You know, during my time in the Wild West, I've had chlamydia. And I've gotten bit by a rattlesnake, too. I didn't know rattlesnakes had chlamydia. The ones that ASU do. Oh! oh very nice! Oh. The ones that ASU do. Oh! Very oh. nice. I like that one. Yeah. Oh, it's very nice. It's nice to be here in Chandler, Arizona. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You know, it's a lot different than it did when I was uh, living here. How so? I mean, before it was just saloons and and pantyhose parties. Now it is, it's Intel and Dutch Bros. Why they got to talk to you inside your car? No, oh, yeah, I, I agree. Uh, back in my time in the Wild West going through Chandler, you know, I had my fair share of quick draw matches at noon, but seems like the only gunslinging that happens now is when a Ford F-150 cuts off a Buick. <laughs> No, exactly. You know, one time I was in a race to someone to Whole Foods, and uh, I actually ended up beating them. And afterwards, they got out of their car and they asked me, like, dude, how much horsepower your stuff got? And I was like, just one. Wait, what's up? Thanks so much for the get in. Yeah, dude. Take pictures? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, you know, uh... Back in our day, you know, we used to hunt and kill. I'd take down the whole buffalo, eat it, use every single part. Nowadays, these people can't even finish fries with their McDouble. Seriously, and my girlfriend can't even finish the drink that she ordered. Yeah, speaking on that, we had moonshine and stuff straight from the barrel. Now they're having white claw and high noons. The only high noon I know is high noon against a guy I'm about to shoot. Oh, oh, I know. Seriously. How much horsepower does that thing have? I'm like, just one, baby. I'm old school. <laughs> That's all it fucking takes. Yeah, yeah, and everyone here is now drinking vodkas and high noons. The only high noon I know is, uh, shoot now. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the last time, uh, damn, what the fuck, uh, <laughs> back in my day, they only had old, they only had old fashions. An old fashioned back in the day was, uh, <laughs> fuck, I don't know. An old fashioned back in the day was, was, uh, was, was what you call missionary sex. <laughs> Uh, uh, well, anyway, <laughs> in my day, old-fashioned just what is what, just what we called missionary sex, <laughs> which also led to chlamydia, and you would die. Uh, yes, exactly. Yes. There was no cure. There was no cure. But now, isn't that a funny story, Alex? That's a funny story. We got a lot more funny stories for you guys out here tonight. We invited some of the best comics around to go ahead and gather around the campfire and tell some tales. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, uh, no. Uh, and don't worry, we'll be... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And don't worry, we'll be right here. We'll be sitting right here, listening to each story and sharing our th Western thoughts when we find appropriate. So let's welcome on our first comedian, Lamar Mitchell. Lamar Mitchell, everybody! <laughs> Oh, 
Are we, we're standing with the mics, right? <laughs> uh, no, we're sitting on the stools. Yeah, but before, the intro, we're staying with the mics. Yeah, of course. Yeah, the riffing. Yeah. Okay. It's a toy. It's a toy. Maybe I'm, nah, maybe I'm been walking all day. Yeah, dude. I, I, I'm going to cross my legs and then sip on a drink. <laughs> with weird. two hands? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to double fist one drink. It's a lot for me. <laughs> I get the shakes. I'm an alcoholic. Okay. How long y'all gonna be on stage? Uh, like, uh, just us. We're gonna be on stage about five minutes. Five up top? Yeah, just five up top. And then, um, then uh, we're gonna introduce the first storyteller. It's gonna be Lamar Mitchell. Lamar, all right. How long is Lamar doing? He's just doing 10. Each comic's doing 10. All right. All right, guys. My name is Lamar Mitchell. Thank you. Give it up. I don't think you could survive a day out in the West. Taunto, no. Yeah, yeah. He'd be time, bro, in a second. No, if Tonto was here, he'd give me some advice, but he needs it more than I do. Yeah, exactly. Are you guys ready for your next storyteller? Woo! <laughs> and then after Lamar, it's gonna be A.V. Reyna. You guys scared me now, or what? <laughs> Me a little bit, me a little bit. Yeah, we, whenever we saw a witch back in the day, we burned them, so. And tattoos are witchy. Just choke me out, I guess. <laughs> we left our lasso in the back. Yeah. Damn shame. See us after the show. No, just kidding, I'm fucking, I'm fucking around. I'm fucking around, everyone. I'm fucking around. I'm a man of the law, I'm fucking around. But yes. Yeah, exactly. You know, thanks for writing me my show. Yeah. That was very nice. You guys have been an awesome audience so far. Give it up for yourselves. Yes. Give it up for yourselves. You look comfortable. I was scared. Yeah, you were sitting, you were sitting down. I was like, I've never seen any of you sit down for anything. I purposely don't sit down because it just makes bad people look bigger. <laughs> And I just will not. Yeah, y'all not gonna catch my bad angles. Fuck that. Okay. Then we're gonna do a, a just put commercial break, and then that'll only be three minutes. Next one we got going on is a big uh, shout out to Fake Plants. Fake Plants for making it look like I have responsibility, but I haven't washed my underwear in six months. We we, we couldn't back in the day. That shit was made out of like people. Yeah. So, no. yeah. <laughs> But I haven't washed my underwear in six months. And we could have back then. It was made out of like cow or people. You know, yeah, one of the two. It's like skin, scrotum skin. That's yeah, what we were. Exactly. Yeah, yeah we're free balling it. Yeah, you gotta wash it in sand. Yes, sir. All right, we got this next one here. <laughs> Second half is uh, then Mason Spina, 10 minutes. So, that's the end of that story. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, it was. It was that's it. That's a natural end to that story. Yeah. 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 Message. We're doing messages. Yeah. Is there a message of the I, story? I, yeah, you guys are fine. Just don't get caught. <laughs> I like that. I also like the point of your story when you asked that one guy to beat up that other guy. There's, that's teamwork. That's what that is. No, I was trying to bring the community together. <laughs> yeah. In hindsight, it is weird that it was his brother, and I thought the one Indian dude was the problem, but the one right next to me would be on my team. <laughs> Hell yeah, well, Indian people didn't do 9-11, everybody. Mason Spina! Chase Harder, 10 minutes. Yeah, I gave up on women after the whole fake to kidnapping thing. I'm just scared to be straight. I feel like Homer Simpson in that meme, but it's just me going into the closet. <laughs> Been there, brother. Yeah. yeah. So that message. <laughs> the message? Message oh. of the story, yes. Yeah. Gay is better. Uh, so far. Fuck yeah. yeah, we like that. Gay is better, everybody. And Tara Shakespeare, 10 minutes. <laughs> it's all good. I'm just warming up in this puzzle back there. Okay. I'm trying to see who in the building. <laughs> How you feeling?
And I'm black, I'm a woman. We talk down on our men so they can fuck us right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you ain't shit. I will show you why ain't shit, bitch. You know what I mean? Like, it works. It works. Y'all see baby boys, stop playing, okay? <sighs> it does work. It does work. It does work. I'm test subject number one, it fucking works, all right, it fucking works. Go through full. Yeah, yeah, that's all. Thank you, dude, you're out. All right, um, that's good, so yeah, I think we're chilling, right? Yes, sir, yeah. Nice, nice. All right, well, that concludes Funny Story, everybody. Thank you guys so much. Thank you all so much for coming out tonight. We really appreciate you guys, every single one of you. Thank you for coming out. Uh, <laughs> Honestly, I kind of want to close that door until the show starts, and just, we'll see. But uh, you want what? Close oh. that door. Yeah, just like seeing everyone trickle in last minute. I'll be like, fuck, dude. Well, I got pee before that. Okay. At five fifty, I'm gonna take a piss. What times right now? Five thirty-seven. Dude, people gotta show up. People I know it's weird, like having people see us before. I'm, I'm happy about Tara. I'm happy about yeah. Rosa Lamar. I'm happy about. Uh, AV killed it, I thought. I thought so too. I, I think, think uh, Mason obvious, just obvious, bro. Yeah, he did. I think yeah. he did really good. But that's the whole point. The, we just gotta like. Yeah. We gotta go also out. It was long. It's 7:40. So what is that? We did an hour and. Well, we 30. started. We started what like 6:20. Yeah. Let's let's go out and meet people. Sorry. All right. Hold we on. Gotta, Let me it's like when you go to a place like when there's oh, no shit. line and then it's like oh man look, good thing we got here in time now there's a line oh shit dude dude it's, it's pretty good oh my god i actually am now relaxed <laughs> <laughs> dude i was like if there's no one i'm killing myself dude i was actually like i wasted everyone's time i'm a loser oh berkeley's here dude, a lot of people are here i know so, did you look in the audience yeah yeah what'd you think though I think the turnout was good though. Yeah, that's that's, yeah, that's, that's nice. <laughs> Yeah, that's kind of. Yeah. This is the real shit. Everyone wants to act. I'm gonna act tough on social media after this. <laughs> but flex up in front of the. Just know in the moment. Drag brunch. Yeah, bro. But just know in the moment though. I was for real like, you're right. I'll never try to do anything again. Oh man. It was good. I know. I, I beat up on myself, dude. I, I, be, I beat up on myself, dude. I fucking. I hit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice show. Yeah. What are you gonna do it again? Uh, what time is it? About six. Showtime. What time Seven. is it, you reckon? It's about showtime. I appreciate you. Hell yeah. Thank you, bro. I appreciate you. Thank you. How you doing? <laughs> What'd you guys think? Honest reaction. Vinny, give me your honest reaction. It was pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty bad. Yeah, it was bad. It was pretty bad. All right. <laughs> I said it was pretty. You want my honest you opinion? Good. Nah, you were good. I do think like wait. So, so. Let's get out there. Cowboy! Ride a cowboy!